All right, people, I finally defeated Weldar after a couple tries. Um, I learned you can kill him with grenades, which I originally thought you could. But the only problem was... Oh, wow, well, yeah, he broke the power, so I can actually get other jiggies now. Yeah, the only problem was you had to be so close to even get them inside of him that it, it, it fucking just put you in more danger than it was worth. Hence why I was using the Kazooie eggs. Because, hey, guess what? I can do them from a far distance. And it doesn't end up killing me. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you do. Uh, I enjoy that boss fight, it's just... I'm retarded. Let's just go with that. I'm way too stu- <laughs> I was way too stupid. I'm gonna have to edit out that, um, fucking... wish be voice there, though. I'm gonna get probably, like, two more jiggies, and then I'm probably just gonna end this, because... I've been recording for far too long, and this level's been taking way too goddamn long. It's getting to the point where I'm just, like, dying of hunger and thirst. And the camera's going to end up killing me more than the actual game. What a fucking surprise. Yep, there we go. Because when the camera changes, it changes my control as well. So, I end up walking off the goddamn edge. Love it. Just loving it. Uh, also, you can get past this thing without killing him. But I usually suggest doing it before you kill him. I mean, doing it after you kill him. Because, I don't know. It's hard to do. I'm needing that. I can't get down there yet. Let me check. Because there is a jiggy down there. Yeah. But I know which ability I need, and I don't get that till I go to Cloud Cuckoo Land. So this is literally the last place I can get any jiggies. Isn't that kind of a weird turn of events? <clears throat> so with that, I guess I got, what, like, three jiggies? out of all that time I played. That's why I can't speedrun this game because it takes way too long once you hit portions like this. Oh, shit. No, 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 thank you, thank you. That's not exactly what I wanted to do, but thank you for your fucking contribution. No, don't, Banjo, don't be an ass. I can get one more jiggy before I'm deciding, hey, I need to go get some food and quit this. But hey, at least I have a super long ass recording for once. Banjo is always wonderful for that. Whereas Legend of Zelda can either be really long recordings or it can just be really short recordings. Such as uh, the one I've previously just did. And Battle Block Theater, that one's always going to be short recordings, which I'm glad for. Because I wouldn't want really long recordings of that. That would just end up sucking out the happiness and the joy and the eccentricness that that game just provides you. It's such a zany game that it's wonderful. I love it. And personally, I would say Battle Block Theater is probably one of my favorite indie titles lately. I still play it. But Castle Crashers has definitely been my go-to indie game. Behemoth knows their comedy and they know their game so fucking well. Be right back. Alright people, I'm back. Now there's going to be, I think, two Jiggies actually up here. Which is wonderful, really. But you can already see how this place is so goddamn reminiscent of witchy, not witchy world, Rusty Bucket Bay. 
Can you not just see that from the aesthetics? Sneak on in here. I get a jiggy in here. I know that. And this is the fabled floor five. There is a rabbit up here. And I believe this is how I get the one platform for that one rabbit. Oh no, it's for this one. I don't remember what this one does. It releases a spring pad, I believe, so I can get up here with um, ease instead of trying to traverse from outside, right? It's a spring pad, right? Yeah, okay, I thought so. Just so I can get back up here easier if I'm inside instead of backtracking all the way. Where the hell is he? He's probably over there. I don't know, I guess I could continue on a little bit further. I just don't want to, really. Come on, you can do it. Just grab that shiny red bar. I also know where he is. It, He's in the one place that only that um, washing machine can reach. I think I can only get over there with the kazooie. I feel like that is the answer, but I could be definitely wrong. But yeah, I feel like I can only get over there with kazooie using glide. Ow. So many things need glide, and I don't want to get glide. You can't make me. I could always do the cheating way. Actually, yeah, I might have to do the cheating way. Bye, bye George. Don't you touch me, you asshole. Bye, bye George. Cheating sometimes helps. You all know how I'm going to be doing this. I wouldn't say it's cheating, it's more kind of exploiting the system. Uh, I need to sleep a little bit so I actually have some health. And then switch off to the kazoo bird. Kazoo bird. Yay, yay, yay. Teleport on, um, yeah, on top of the roof. Ow, my ear, my ear, my ear, my ear. Okay, my glasses are falling off now. Why do I only have three health? Like, why are you discriminating against the bird? Racist bastards. Well, I guess I just needed to actually use Kazooie. So what, I have 51? That means I have 4 out of the 10 Jiggies that I have here. Alright, 4 out of 10. View totals. Yeah, 4 out of 10. I believe I can get one more, and then we will actually end this. Whee! I'm trying to think, though. Where would be that last one? I could get a Jinjo, actually. I could can try... Actually, yeah, I could try to do some of the rabbits. I just don't really want to. I mean, obviously, there's a reasoning to that, and that's because I can't get one of them. Like, it's literally impossible for me to get one of them. Okay. Mm, yeah. I just want it. I really want it. There we go. Oh, wow! You know, I tapped A. I tapped it. I said fucking fly. Know how she responded? She's like, <laughs> nope. 
And death. That's what happens when you don't fucking listen, bird. You die. This world is cruel. It's a heinous place. I guess you don't give a shit. Stupid ass bird. Fuck you. <sighs> There's another thing here that I can get, I believe. I don't know, I'm still trying to search for that mystical panel that allows me to uh, free that, I don't know, metal block, I guess you would call it. Okay, that works, I guess. I don't know, so why not? Oh, that really hurt a lot, actually. Yeah, he's in here, and the only way to get in here with the washing machine is to go through that authorized personnel door. Whatever, no big D. There's another thing in here, though, right? There's a Jinjo. And that's why I could hear him, because these rooms are connected. Oh. Yeah, that's a surefire sign that I need to eat. Stop your bitching, man. I'll get you cleaned. It's honestly not that big of a deal anyways. Okay, finally. Thought it was going to be another trick. Was, Jesus. <gasps> Dude, I already know. Are you going to honestly tell me this every single time we meet? Because honestly, you're getting repetitive. You're getting annoying. You're getting a little bit on my nerves. So please stop it. And I believe that's everything that's on the roof. There's going to be one that appears in a chimney stack later on, but I could care less about that. I'm just going to get that Jinjo and we'll be on our way. Okay, how am I gonna do this? We're gonna have to do some... Oh, this is not gonna be fun, is this? You know what? Fuck it. I don't wanna go, go go do that because I need to go eat. And honestly, the backtracking is just gonna drive me bonkers. I'm starting to become really aggravated and tired and I just need to take a break. I've been recording for far too long. Anyways, thank you people for watching. Um, yeah, stay beautiful. You're all fucking awesome. And to everybody who's continuing to watch my stuff and making the channel grow, thank you. You're all beautiful. You're fucking awesome people. Anyways, I'm out. Peace.